In this tutorial I'm just going to show you very quickly how to use the 2P module to access your Twitter account and post your statuses or retrieve any kind of Twitter stuff that you want to do. Um, the first thing you need to do is you need to get yourself some Twitter authentication keys um, which is just so you go to developer.twitter.com uh, you get your keys from there. I have another video where I've done that so I'll link that in the description uh, to save you time on this one so if you just go ahead and do that yeah, and once you've got your keys, you're good to go. So the first thing you need to do is install Tweepy. And you can see I've already done that, I've got that here. Uh, once you've done that, you need to fire up your interpreter, import your Tweepy module, and then I will import my get tokens file, uh, which is just this file that I keep all my tokens in. Uh, once you've done that, you need to set the auth authentications for your, your 2P handler. Uh, this part is your consumer key. Uh, which I take from my file obviously. Then it's your consumer secret. and then you need to set your access token my access key and then I need my access secret and then once that's done I set authentication and then you're good to go um, and you can just go straight to the 2P documentation page and you can see here this is a very limited list of what 2P is, is, is capable of doing um, to see a full list or a, a better list you can go here you type in directory for your API that you've just created and you can see a long list of methods that is available for you to use with Tweepy. Um, and one that we're going to use just now to demonstrate, if you look carefully you'll see it in this screen somewhere. Oh, I can't see it, okay, but we will use status methods and we will use update status this one here and you can see here from the documentation it is simply you can input status and these other parameters are optional update status and here we can fire off the command updated from Tweepy and there you go and you get some feedback from that that's fine um, and then what we can do is we can actually check my Twitter account and see here if we refresh the screen uh -huh, we have one new tweet and there you go updated from Tweepy and there you go that is a really quick way just to show you how you can actually use Tweepy to update or interact with your Twitter account um, so I would recommend checking out the documentation there are lots of different methods that you can use uh, you can build your own bot which I'll get to in another video um, and then that's it enjoy thank you very much